A weaker pound does happen, we can have a very different impact on businesses, depending on what they do. Ben Shaw looks into it. And some other news around today. A report into the collapse of Lehman Brothers has criticised senior executives and the auditor, Ernst & Young, for serious lapses that led to the firm's collapse. The report showed that Lehman's was insolvent for weeks before it filed for bankruptcy in 2008. It also said that there could be grounds for legal action against former executives. HSBC has admitted that around 24,000 than Pat began. Time to look at the markets as well. We've had a very positive end to the week for the main markets. The FTSE 100 up about 16 points. If we look at the shares we're most likely to own, the most popular shares, this thing isn't working, guys, in the gallery. Could you switch on the board for me? I can tell you, though, that the banks are doing well. Also, British Airways shares are up around 4.5%. Thank you very much, the boys behind the scenes. Also, shares in B Sky B are gaining after reports that Rupert Murdoch's News Corp, which already owns 39%, of the pay TV broadcaster may buy the shares it doesn't already know. And you can see that B Sky B has had a very good run over this year so far. An innovative way of keeping an eye on the road. Matt Proger checks it out. The car